my name is Caroline Jeffrey and I am currently in my second year of graduate school and in May I'm going to graduate with my master's degree in speech language pathology. So the research that I've been doing over the past few semesters has sought to answer the question, do children who've spent time in foster care have any difficulties with social communication and if they do, what kind of difficulties do they have? So to figure this out, I developed a survey for parents who have adopted children out of foster care to just ask more about their child's social communication abilities. And I did this by following our everyday speech curriculum, which is an evidence-based program that we use in our clinic, and just kind of forming questions based on that curriculum. So I had parents report on their children's social communication in a survey, and then they were also able to give an email to do follow-up phone interviews, and I got some more qualitative data that way. And the biggest thing I found in going through the data and talking to parents is that their children often have a lot of difficulties with peer interactions and forming relationships with others. And these children are often gonna be seen in the schools at this point in their life, where as speech language pathologists, we're often trying to support them in their academics and in the ways that they use language in school but there's also a need for us to support them in their social skills too, because research shows us that if you can connect well with others and have good interpersonal relationships, it benefits your quality of life. So it would not just help these students academically, but also just all around with their quality of life.